Okay, my dear students, today I would like to discuss a very simple and easy techniques to solve the problems of hemispherical surface on which if any body is kept, let us see what is going to happen here. For example, at this point A, if you keep any body and its velocity is going to be zero after how much distance on the hemispherical surface it will travel and uh, it will leave the hemispherical surface. That's it. It has to leave the hemi hemispherical surface and it has to fall as a freely falling body. So let us see what is that height here. Uh, here one more diagram is given in which velocity of a body is given zero here and you all know that if you are going to consider the velocity, velocity is considered to be nRg, okay, uh, like 5rg, 3rg, 2rg, whatever it may be, but as the velocity is going to be zero here, uh, therefore n is also considered to be zero here at this place. So as n is considered to be zero, there is a shortcut formula to find out this angle, like angle theta is asking us to find out so what is the formula shortcut formula for finding the angle theta is nothing but cos theta is going to be equal to 2 minus n by 3 this shortcut formula if you use you can solve the problem in fraction of seconds without solving the problem you can solve the problem by just seeing the question you can directly write the answer so cos theta is equal to 2 minus n by 3 uh, which is nothing but according to this diagram given here we can write it as cos theta is equal to adjacent side by hypotenuse that is going to be h by r as v is equal to 0 n is also going to be 0 here so we can write 2 minus 0 by 3 is equal to h by r <coughs> then what is h here this implies that h is going to be 2r by 3 that's it you got the answer in just fraction of seconds thank you